Hello and welcome to the Hanseatic city of Bremen. We're here at the Von Invest Weserstadion. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And the focus is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. It's Werder Bremen against Borussia Dortmund. Yeah, thank you, Derek. I'm really looking forward to this. Both teams certainly capable of producing some entertaining football. Hopefully we'll get that. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Lee? Well, four goals in his last three games. He's in superb form. He's going to be really hard to stop. The defenders need to be on their game. And a look at the starting 11 for Werder Bremen. Now, there has been some discussion about their style of play. Some would argue it's on the negative side. What realistically should we expect, Lee? Yeah, they do tend to collapse when they don't have the ball. They sit off the opposition, almost inviting pressure onto them before trying to open up when they do have the ball. I don't think we'll see any changes today in that approach. And introducing the Borussia Dortmund side, Roman Burki gets the nod in goal. Mats Hummel starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence. Axel Witzel starts alongside Mahmoud Dahoud in the centre of the pitch. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Augustinsson. It's with Mürwald. Eggestein. Bittencourt and teammates to play it to Gebre Zelassi nice switch of play Augustinsson might be able to get in behind the defence well that'll be a free kick and can he find someone at the far post Marco Reis, Dahoud. Jaden Sancho, the ball with Marco Reis. Now can they create something? And it goes! That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, here's the replay. It's a really lovely through ball. And he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. So back in business in this match, and Borussia Dortmund hold the lead. Velkovic. And on the ball, Friedel. Well, Dortmund have it once again. This looks promising. Corner coming up for Dortmund. Royce taking this one. And it all counts for naught. Chong. Marco Friedl. And 
and the perfect position to read it. Giving the ball away. Reina. Holland. Possession one. Eggestein. Gebre Selassie. Eggestein. Well, no luck keeping possession. Dortmund have not had too much of the ball, but on the break they've been devastating. The pace really... And he's in. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, as we look at this again, what they always say, focus on the ball, ensure you strike it cleanly. He's done just that. What a finish. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Second goal for them here. Augustinsson. Great vision to switch the play. Have they given him too much space? And the cross is very much on. Gebre Selassie. Not showing good patience. Using his physical strength to shield it. Gabriel Zelassi. Josh Sargent. And pulled back. Gabriel Zelassi. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. Real chance. Another goal! And surely there's no way they can throw this away. Absolutely dominant. Well, let's see the replay and look at the pace at which the counter-attack happens. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal. with the action and Borussia Dortmund appear to be out of sight well, there is going to be stoppage time but only the one minute and so it is the first half story has been written Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's having a terrific game and attack, Lee. Well, they've really struggled to keep him under wraps today. He's simple. His movement really causes defenders problems. And he's done that again today. So, back in business. Borussia Dortmund very much bossing it in the first 45 here. Let's see how the second half pans out. Jadon Sancho. Now Minier. Dahoud Axel Witzel Unable to keep the ball that time And a free kick awarded by the referee And appeared to be on the cusp of being booked But got away with that one Bittencourt and here's Gebre Selassie Eggestein Kevin Möwald 
And it's with Eggestein. An attack full of promise. And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. Well, here's the replay. Look at this, Derek. How cheeky is this? You look a bit daft if you miss, but a genius when it comes off. Brilliant stuff. have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game no shortage of goals in this match 3-1 Osako Eggestein and he might be through here oh offside how marginal was that but the flag is raised Marco Reis. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Jaden Sancho. It is going to be a Dortmund free kick. And that short pass, this could be interesting. Reis. Will it be? Wonderful challenge, but the chance is still on. Guerrero Marco Reus well just a whisker wide of the post not a bad effort at all Well, Bremen certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession. After that, it's been a little bit disappointing. Creativity in midfield is a little bit off. Certainly too slow in front of goal. Need to get wide, need to get crosses in the box. Kevin Murwald. Promising attack, this. Augustinsson. Osako. Holland. They've lost the ball, Dortmund. Bittencourt. And it's with Eggestein. And space for the cross. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. And time for the change now. Now what on earth happened there? Holland might be able to set up the chance very much run of the mill as saves go Chong Eggestein Lovely ball over the top. And the ruling is offside here. Substitution it is for Dortmund. Hummers. Reus. Erling Haaland. Good visualisation and execution. And lining it up. And a pretty straightforward stop for the goalkeeper there. Yeah, weak shot, straight at him, no problem for the goalie. And just the one minute left in normal time here.
very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. The end of the game then, officially, and the victory for the Schwarz-Gelben. Lee, how did you see it? Yeah, their two-goal advantage in the end was just reward for their good play today for me. Worthy winners. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance, ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, 9 out of 10. something in it goes that will do nicely for starters first goal of the game and he's in and he scored not once but twice they simply cannot stop him and no wonder he's enjoying himself Another goal! And surely there's no way they can throw this away. Absolutely dominant. In it goes. A well-taken penalty. Marco Reus. Well, just a whisker wide of the post. Not a bad effort at all. 